The V-2 rocket, or Vergeltungswaffe II, was the brainchild of German engineer Wernher von Braun and his team. Development began in the late 1930s at the secret Peenemünde Army Research Center. The goal was to create a weapon capable of delivering a devastating payload over long distances. The V-2 was a technological marvel for its time. Standing 14 meters tall and weighing over 12 tons, it was powered by a liquid-fuel rocket engine. It could reach altitudes of up to 200 kilometers and travel at speeds exceeding 5,700 kilometers per hour. Its range of about 320 kilometers allowed it to strike targets far from the launch site. The first successful test flight of the V-2 rocket occurred on October 3, 1942. By September 1944, it was deployed against Allied cities, with London and Antwerp being primary targets. The V-2 was nearly unstoppable as it descended at supersonic speeds, giving little warning before impact. The V-2 rocket caused significant destruction and loss of life. Over 3,000 were launched, killing approximately 9,000 people. However, its psychological impact was arguably greater, instilling fear and uncertainty among civilians. Despite its devastation, the V-2's advanced technology laid the groundwork for future space exploration. After the war, many V-2 scientists, including Wernher von Braun, were taken to the United States and the Soviet Union under Operation Paperclip. Their expertise was pivotal in the development of both countries' ballistic missile programs and the eventual race to space. The V-2 rocket's legacy is a testament to the dual-edged sword of technological advancement. The V-2 rocket stands as a milestone in military history, marking the dawn of modern rocketry. Its creation changed the landscape of warfare and science forever. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more deep dives into the history of warfare and technology.